Hey all losers, and welcome back to Long War 2. We have Moisha and Co. dealing with the things. Yeah, we're, we're, we're dealing with a lot of things actually, and uh, we're apparently missing and f shanking a lot of shots. Let's not do that so much, eh? Let's get right up to this faceless here. Please don't activate anything new, David. Thank you, David. 100% with a shotgun. This thing better die. Thank you! So, if you can't guess from the Goo Man involved, we are on a, uh, a Rendez Vaus uh, with a lot of these people, as everyone who speaks French slowly bleeds out from their ears. We are on a rendezvous um, to stop the collaborators from getting their mitts on dirty, dirty advent goods. And we've done a pretty good ambush so far. Ibrahim, Moisha, and Co. are all back. They're all awesome, they're all ready. And we're all pretty happy about how things are going. Luckily, we didn't get walked up on, which is awesome. Also, we're going to take the opportunity, because we are have unlimited time in this mission, to reload and grab some loot, grab some goods, suppressor and stock. Vulture already coming in handy, baby. For those little level one things, I may start doing those Proving Ground projects, honestly, at this point. And I could go advance much further here, but I don't want to. Because I know there's obviously more on this map and Illyrium core from the Faceless. I don't know where he was sticking that core. I don't, you know what? If that's a Faceless suppository, I don't even want to know, actually. Come to think of it, I don't want to know where he kept that. Just let, keep, li let the Goo Man have his secrets, okay? That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. That and Faceless suppositories, okay? It's an image that no one wanted to have in their heads, but now you do. So Hoda is going to get up here, though, because Hoda has high ground bonuses, which is crazy for a resistance member, but I'm very happy about that. Because that makes her more badass. Um, Rockstar. So what? Can you get around... Like, I want to move her, uh, but I kind of don't. Because I don't want to activate anything new. So, you know, we're just going to take a turn. Not do anything crazy. Have Moisha do his Moisha thing. Have Malachi do his Malachi thing. And Hoda's up in the tree. Okay, so... No one moved forward and the points don't matter. Okay, no worries. Moisha, tell me what we won. What does Ibrahim run this time? He runs assault. He upgraded his MG to an assault rifle. His movement, however, All still right, sucks the big go. one. I hear more faceless on the map, but they are revealed, maybe? So I'm not really sure if that implies that we actually have not a, problem. a better time of it in the sense that we're not going to lose resistance members to this? Or, I don't know, actually. I'm not entirely certain how that works. Oh, God, do you see the goo pool that was coming out of this dude? Look at this. I think that Illyrium core was a suppository. That is coming straight out of his rectum. Like, oh my, what, XCOM 2, why, Solomon, why, what the hell, man? That's an image I did not need in my head. Holy shit, okay. I was gonna not curse at this point, but oh my God, that's the most disgusting thing I've seen in a long time, and I did not see that. Thank you for that. Or actually, don't thank for that. That's god awful. Reload, Hoda, and give me high ground. I don't know if we're going to get to use the high ground. We never get to use high ground in these missions, huh? It feels like I'm missing out. Taking them reloads. Malachi, I'm thinking, is not going to get to use his high ground, even if we really want him to. Let's get him right here by the tree. Get action cam footage of Malachi in his ratty-ass shirt, and we'll see what happens there. I'm not mocking your shirt, buddy. Actually, I am, but... I know there's not much you can do about it, so it's kind of a dick move. I, I, I agree. It's kind of a dick move. I should stop talking about your shirt. There's nothing you can do about that. I understand. I understand, man. Ibrahim, clear? do you have anyone? Do you see anyone? Почему нет? Сука, блядь. Oh, hi, Faceless. That's a cheat little vision that we have there. Okay, so there's a patrol of Fastlies right around there. We got pretty damn lucky we didn't actually trigger that before. I think the only reason to trigger that is this double height... Uh, Thingy wingy, what is this thing? It's a loader. No, no, no. I'm not sure then if Hoda can get us the high ground bonus we so richly deserve here. I'm gonna try though, especially if that patrols into us. But we know there's a face that's right around there. That means Ibrahim can used to come back here. Come here. Uh let's go here. We need to what's over there. I don't know, man. Maybe it's like contact and stuff. Mm. So I also know that there's a faceless. I don't want to move Malachi up any further either because if there's other stuff there that's not being factored into by the whole activation mode, then I want to know about that. Hey, so Rockstar. Okay, so no, I think that's a static pack. I'm a shock to your system. All right, come on here. This is obviously an activation. We know it's there. Hey, what's up? Okay, so that one was a face. Is there two faces in? Oh god, it's like coming out of a faceless cocoon. 
What's going on here? There's a faceless... Is that a triple faceless pod? Did I just see that right? No, double faceless pod. I'm only slightly wrong. Hobie Bejeebus. That advent gunner is in the open. That faceless is right there, and we are scared. Hoda. Do we have that Hoda? Suleiman. She does not have height bonus for us. God damn it. I mean, I could just leave her on Overwatch for the height bonus. I really want to keep that damn height bonus if possible. Well, this is frightening. Malachi, you have a 69 on that gunner. That gunner could be a massive problem with the suppression. Maybe. But also the trooper and also everything else. God damn. Um, well, Ibrahim, get up I here. Because you're probably going to be one of the few that can actually do something for me. Can you pitch a... Nah, that flash is a little too far out. It's far out, man. David Byton can totally do stuff for me, bruh. Uh, you can only see the fastless. Uh, Malachi, you can see these things, but you know, it's dangerous. 69, 75 on the faceless. I feel like... Man. I feel like a gonna... Okay, uh, I don't know what the hell I'm gonna do right now. That's why I'm kind of stalling for time. If you hadn't guessed. I'm not really certain the best move here. Besides putting David here and maybe pitching a flash. Because everyone got a flash. I think I need a turn to reorient this. because But that gunner is just such a juicy freaking target. That it makes my... I'm gonna stop that thought right there uh shoot the balls like i want malachi to take a shot i want moisha to take a shot rockstar is gonna do stuff and biting this guy we have to wait we, do we have triple shot here did i miss oh no malachi's got a oh that's why he's got a 69 on that guy because he actually has a rifle that makes a lot more sense i'm like why the hell do these people with shotguns have such good aim at long ranges answer they don't all right so let me let me do let me do like this huh Let's bring Moisha here. Yes, come here. Can we go ahead and flashbang this whole shit bag? We can. He's still going. He's still going, people. All right, there we go. So we can flashbang this two douchebags, which is going to be important. And hopefully we will not get punched in the face by faceless. I, it's the fury of knocking a face that makes them punch people in the face. I think I've decided this now. This is now canon in my head. Uh, Ibrahim is going to be an Overwatch there. Hoda is going to be an Overwatch, which I may regret in the future. But you know what? They're going to run up on me, right? That's what I'm telling myself. I can't stop myself from killing you. All right, let's get um, uh, biting All right, around here. And see how good your shots are on face. Face, 5%. No, we're going to go ahead and do this also here. Because if I'm going to shotgun something, I'm going to do it from close range. It's going to hurt. Always going to hurt. Can we get this guy dead? If we can do this in combat protocol, that SOB to death. That'd be fantastic. He likes his gourds. I don't know. I'm reading more language out of Advent now. I'm not sure if that was like, give me calabash. Or like, that is not a bush. Or like, I don't know. I'm trying to I'm trying to figure this out, man. Just give me a break. Uh you have cover though, apparently. You 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 are flanked but aren't flanked at the same time. This dude is in quantum superposition of suck. It's kinda weird. Alright, well just shoot this thing, I guess, Rockstar. Try not to get hit by it in the face, okay? Seven damage. Not a bad roll at all. Let's see if our overwatches and our Oh, he heals. Oh, son of a bitch. He heals. The faceless now have regenerative properties. And that one's got 12 HP. What is that? Like super faceless? Ibrahim! You suck! 42%. Hoda! Hoda! Give me that shot, Hoda! Hoda! From high ground! God damn it! <laughs> that totally did not pay off at all! At least I had to double move to get close to us, which is what we wanted to see. Trooper taking a crappy shot. Trooper missing a crappy shot. 8% is kind of what I want to see around these days. Uh, what are you doing? Taking a crappy shot for 1%. Good. I like this better. Other faceless. Come on in. The water's fine. He's like, I can double move because I'm a douchebag. Okay. So apparently we missed every single shot that was worth a damn here. But now we have things in range with shotguns, maybe. This is good. Hi. You need to die. This is the 12 HP guy that's currently being a pain in the asshole. Yeah, he is. All right. So, hey, dude. Hey, dude. Kill him. Six. Very close to being good. If I could... I surely would. I'll get Malachi to take a shot at him with the rifle. Now we use a shotgun on the other face, lass. And we'll have to deal with the, the problems that the other one faces regardless. <laughs> get it? It's a faceless joke because I said about a face and now the face is really angry at me. Okay, sorry. 
Biting, you got a shoddy. And we're gonna try to flank these uh, advent chumps. Please do good damage to this. I would really appreciate it if you would. 100%. Come on, baby. Four damage. That was a min roll and kind of the opposite of what I wanted you to do, David. God damn it. Stay with me, David. All right. Uh, Ibrahim, come here. Come here. Uh, get over there. I'm going. Oh, stop being such a worry wart. Uh, 65. Do it. For great justice. Damn it. All these rookies yeah, suck at aiming at things. Yeah, because you keep missing shots. Let's Funny how those two things correlate, dumbass. Alright, this is not going- I'm getting- I'm getting frustrated now, and I really shouldn't be- Shouldn't be mocking my poor soldiers, but right now they're not meeting expectations. Come on! You damaged for three. Minimum rolls are the wave of the future. You heard it here first, people. Alright. I'm not taking any risks here. Hold on, what are the shots I hear? What are the shots I got here? 77. Alright, 77 is not great. I'm gonna actually combat protocol that because I don't trust myself. Uh, aid protocol is gonna go on Rockstar because she's likely flankable, I think. No, who's behind? Is she flankable? If this guy's full movement, he can easily flank Rockstar, I think. Might not be able to flank Malachi because of the double height here. So I am gonna aid protocol self, which is greedy, but fair. I'm gonna combat protocol douchebag. Those faces do a lot of damage. The gunner could do serious pain on us too, but since we didn't hit a damn thing, that's kind of uh, our problem overall. Uh, disorientation removed, which is, this is the problem. This is when people die, primarily. But we still have some, you're gonna try to, yeah, this is exactly what I thought he was gonna do. He's gonna try to hit rocks. Oh, he can actually get Malachi over the, oh God, Malachi. Okay, so I thought the double height would protect Malachi. That obviously was not the case. He's gonna try to shoot Malachi behind full cover, and it's a kill. Graze for 21%. He grazed for three. God damn it. And now everything goes south because everyone from the thing goes, oh my god, someone died. Okay, that's that's really not good. At least Moish is still alive to take vengeance, but Malachi is no longer among the living. David's gonna have to deal with this advent gunner. Rockstar's probably gonna have to deal with this douchebag, um, but we're not sure how we're gonna do that yet. Oh, that's really sad, actually. Okay. So that's, that's depressing. I really wish that didn't happen, but when you do stuff like that, you kind of expect it, unfortunately. I had to, I had to take some seriously hard decisions on how I was going to move, and that did not work out according to plan. These guys have my number right now, which is really frustrating. All right, Moisha, uh, your shotgun is not going to be of any use right now. David, are you going to require to move through this angle if I want to get here? I don't think Moisha's going to block you in any meaningful way. Let's get Moisha back here. We're going to start grenading the crap out of this, because the... Eternal solution of XCOM. We missed too many obvious shots and grazes and low rolls on the uh, the face last. We're not going to break this guy's cover, I don't think. So we're going to have to try to do this the hard way. Can we do this? I actually never heard that torque vocalization. I thought for a minute I like activated another face list. That was freaky as hell. I did not realize that was a torque sound. That's pretty damn funny. All right, Hoda. Hoda, give me a shot. 68% Hoda. You gotta be, you gotta be the woman here. Come on. God damn it, Hoda. Missing 70% all over the place right now. David Byton is gonna be set on fire by this likely, but at this point, what's better? This is, yeah, but I need to get as close as possible. No, the fire's over there. This should be okay before the mission ends. David, of course, is 3 HP with a shotgun, which is... Not what I would call a good solution for long-term life expectancy, but hey, whatever. He enjoys shooting things in the face with a shotgun, so you know what? Good job, David. Alright, so now, Rockstar, gonna have to do something about that, and that's probably gonna involve a flashbang to the face. Because I think at that point, he's got nothing going for him. If I can flashbang him and take cover on this corner, I can then probably maybe sneak around. I've got enough arm for this, no problem. Yeah, I just don't have another good... If I move forward position here, he can probably still move and get me. If I go here, though, he probably can't. So let me do that. I'm really too confident this is all that's on the map. I'm really kind of sad about that guy going down, but... What are you going to do with situations like this? Just weep. Weep the dead. <laughs> oh, God. Trample the weak, hurdle the dead, and all stuff like that. Alright, you're disorientated. This guy takes another life. I'm going to be hella pissed at him. Like, bro. You don't even know. What's up, Trooper? Right, disoriented, taking a shot in the third. I mean, he, he, with, if they're grazing for three, if they're grazing for three, we got a problem. 
Ibrahim, hey, you pulled your head out of your ass. Good job. All right. Rockstar can probably just end that fellow. End him rightly, so to speak. Um, anywhere you move, you will be set on fire. Fantastic, David. Okay, your life expectancy is also reducing greatly. What the hell happened to this mission? This was going so well, and then it's like, no, no, we're completely screwed. All right, Moishi, get over here, get behind this full cover, and we'll make that trooper have a dead day pretty soon. Suleiman can get here, but she has no rounds with what to do things with. What? Uh, let's see, can we get a flashbang down on this guy again? Yeah, you can reflash him, which is going to be the idea. I want to keep him cornered like a rabid dog. Kind of sad about losing Malachi there. Moisha lost his buddy. Um, and let's get Rockstar on the corner here, flanking this SOB and maybe killing him, maybe. Yeah, this is a little risky. She might get flanked in herself, but if she gets a good roll on this, we'll be okay. 98%. Her aim is not the best, which is why we gave her a hybrid build. But good enough for the kill on 5 damage. Okay. So two more pieces of goods, which is great on this. Unfortunately, we lose a... Status Resistance member, Operation Mission Hell Queen, that kind of sucks. Um, I don't know how much we lost from the Faceless either, but that's going to hurt that place, obviously, considerably, that Haven. So we lost Malachi, unfortunately, the most under fire, on a 21% graze. It was bad luck, yeah, but you got to kind of count on bad luck. I, I miscalculated on the flank, which was the issue. I thought the double height pole would block him, but apparently it only works for mechs and other things that uh, don't need to be shot because Advent says so. So I'm a little frustrated at that. The 20% Grace killing him was shitty, but what are you going to do? That is XCOM luck for you. But everyone else came out okay. Everyone's got to be mourning the loss. Obviously, no one's too happy about this, but... Hey, we got a double faceless activation. We handled it pretty damn well. And on a pretty spread out activation, too. So, I mean, I think, I think we did the best we could with the shots we were given. And we weren't given a lot, which was the sad part. Rolling low, rolling threes, rolling grazes. Not a good, not a good mission, unfortunately, but we did it. We killed the spy, unfortunately sacrificing our own in the process. Hopefully we'll recruit him soon, and then all will be better with the world. Now, if we could just do this load up back at base a little quicker, because honestly, there's not that much to load back at base. Can we, can we do something with this loading time, folks? Because this is bloody ridiculous. Like, I know I lost, there we go. God damn. That took way too long. Come on now. And this is taking like, man, what is... Is my computer, like, crunching numbers for the Philippines or something? What the fuck is being infected in here? This is so slow today. Hi, hey, come on, guys. There we go. Hi, hey, friend. So, we learned two things. We learned that Malachi apparently is a disembodied head on a torso. Uh, maybe this is his death mask. I'm not sure because his neck is torqued at a weird angle. We also learned that faceless keep Illyrium cores up their ass. That's what we learned on this mission, too. I don't know if you learned that. I learned that. And that scared me a lot. Savior's probably not necessary here. I'll probably take Cool Under Pressure for Rockstar. It's definitely a hybrid build, as you see, but I think that's necessary. Uh, we'll do Cool Under Pressure here uh, to make her viability as a Haven Advisor even better. Sadness abounds, though, as we lose one of our own. Psy PSCS gives us what we need as well. Lots of goods, though, and we can use that for sure. All right, and we are back. Oh, minor break there to look at any strategic things I need to do, and the answer is nay, so we're going to keep going. Uh, we're probably going to spend much of the next supply drop, which is coming in about nine days, uh, on armor. That's the next big investment. And then we're probably going to go shift to mag weapons or something. That's probably the next set of things that we need to get done. Looks like Tango's got hack workstation here on a 97. How big was that mission? I don't know. Avon Strength in East Africa is 5, though. It's probably going to start going up. Um, I'm really kind of sad about this. So the other thing I want to talk about on the strategy map is kind of how I'm going to go about this. Now, I do know I want to make contact this way. So we think about how many towers we need to build, practically, right? We need to build one here in New Australia. It'll give us arm to the teeth, uh, which brings us to Western U.S. We need to build one in Western U.S. to make this contact feasible. We can go to New Mexico, build one in New Mexico to go to Eastern U.S., which links to nothing. So that's the only way to do there. So it's one, two, three towers to build. If we go west, we don't need to build one in New Chile. We need to build one in New Brazil. It's one, New Mexico, two. And that's it, basically, to get there. So it's cheaper on towers, it's more expensive on intel. And this will actually get me more regions, I think. I didn't miscount that, did I? No, we build one in New Chile, sorry. <laughs> one, two, three. So the same amount of towers, more regions unlocked. And I think that's fine, because I need other places to do operations. Right now, these are getting a little hot and heavy with advent strength. I need, like, options, basically. Oh my god, I need options. So I'm going to try 
Um, and I was going to quote John Mayer there, but I won't. I'll spare you. Um, to make, I can also go East. No, that's that's just as much. I need to get a free contact. I need this 80, 80 Intel one, basically, uh, that we're going to try to make use of and make our fifth contact that way. That's my plan. It may take longer to get to the black site, but I think that's how I'm going to try to play this one. If this is wrong and we'll lose, then okay, whatever. I mean, it's our first go at this. If I beat Long War II, first go, that would be weird. Okay, Wolf. Grats, you got lead by example. That's excellent. Defilade. Oh my god, this is so like. <laughs> Defilade. All allies within command range of the Elsa gain 10 to hit on reaction fire. That's pretty sick. Um, but, 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 uh, we do have a major now, so maybe enhanced infill would help as well for our cash next time. I'm going to start putting other officers in the officer training now. I need to get people with. Uh, where are you? Is this officer training? Officer training, yep. We need to get people with incoming uh, much sooner than we've been getting right now. Calvin, I think. Who's got the most injured squad right now? Wait, who can... Is Mammy on mission already again? It must be. Okay, well, Calvin, get in there. And you've got incoming already. So, trial by fire. Probably not because you're the top squad. Jammer is probably what we're going to go with here. See how that goes for us. What is Mammy on mission right now? What the hell? I think he must be infiltrating. I was sure he was off mission already, but I guess not. Uh, and Reyna, I think, should be... Not Reyna. Mary should be off of bleeding time. Here, let's look at the status real quick. Let's see. Infiltrating is... Uh, no, Mammy's just dead, apparently. Where the f*** is Mammy? Uh, by class, maybe? Did we kill Mammy? What is going on? Uh, there we go. Mammy. There he is. Lightly wounded. Oh, he's still wounded. Oh, you bitch. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but seriously, as I was saying, Mary... <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to say that. Um, Yeah, Mary is no longer wounded. So we can respec her, which we will. She'll be Overwatch spec. Uh, we'll do that off screen if necessary. And we'll get some more officer training done in the meanwhile. By the by. Um, so where are we sitting on Tango? Tango's at 95%. We're probably going to hit that mission next. Amistad is still 5 in East Africa. Ray's got dead shot train, which is pretty sick. Center mass formidable. Formidable would be good on Ray, but let's get someone else in there and let's just see what the squads look like as far as the mission capabilities go so we can make sure we optimize uh, how we put where and what and things. Okay, squad management. So who's gone? Who's on mission right now? So Ray's squad is here. We'll out for eight and three. Here we're training eight and nine. So I'm. And Mammy is out in three. I, I can see this squad going on mission probably before Victory Squad goes on mission. So let's grab someone from Victory. Uh, let's see. Tank. We got. Oh no! 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 God damn it! Not what I meant to do. Get in there. I hate that. Uh, view squad. Squad view. There. That's not also not what I meant to do. <sighs> God, squad soldiers. Yeah. Can I just see? Okay. So crazy chef, Doc, Papa Smurf, Ma Ma Mary's still there. Ubermensch just got trained. Bard could train up, I guess. Um, yeah, let's try to get some people in there. Le Roi is also could be a pretty good choice uh, since he is quick studied. Let's see if we can get Le Roi in there. Uh, let's get Psy Operative by class, yeah? There we go. What can you train? Precision shot, two days. Mm, he doesn't have good aim. Quick draw, probably good. Oh, he does. Wow, quick study is amazing. Take a. Uh, Am I gonna give him quick draw as a pistol? Dude, he's gonna be able to, like seven actions a turn. That's pretty sick. Let's go ahead and do with quick draw, I guess. Hey, if it's two turns to do that, I am not complaining in the least. Let's go back to the go back to the strategy map, and then we're probably gonna have to infiltrate down here, is my guess. Uh, let me do one thing really quick on the option. Oh god damn it. No, I uh, I can't just go to edit options from there. I need to see gameplay. There's gonna be a no. Where is the... Okay, am I going to do this later? I just want to see... One more, two... Pause and repeat. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, save and exit. Good. I'm turning the game. Okay. Enough. Enough with the freaking things. Do, do do other things. Go, 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 go. New target acquired. What do we have? We have a... Destroy the alien relay. Prevent the resistance data leak. Moderate in four days, two hours. God damn. We... Our haven would be in danger if we don't take this. I kind of have to take this. Um, and Tango's at 97%. How's this mission doing? This is four hours till 100%. And that's how much more can we over infiltrate? Not much more than that. 
Right, that's going to be a moderate mission as well. And how big is this infiltration squad? I think it's pretty damn big, actually. So we should be fine on that moderate. That other moderate is scaring me, though. Um, okay. We may have to boost that other moderate. How much does a boost cost? 25. Yeah, so we'll still make a net bonus on that. Let's get that, let's get that set up. Because I don't, I do want to stop this resistance data leak. And I don't want to have a haven attack on a nine strength region. That feels like that would be freaking bad. Let's go hit that mission. Let's go hit it, baby. Problem is, Mammy's not going to be around for this. Infiltration bonus is not going to exist. Yeah, exactly. With boost. With the boost, we can hit a moderate on... Yeah. Huh. Could we, if we cool out... Oh, this is Loa's weapon? This is Loa's weapon. Alright, we got a suppressor on there. Can we do this better? Not really. Okay, so we need to cull out a unit. If possible. Ray, how do you have an SMG? God, where are all these guns, and why don't I have any? <laughs> what is going on? What the hell is going on? Um, I'll have to steal a gun from somebody, but we need to cull out a unit here. There we go. So now we can go light and moderate. Really? Five man on a 75% boost? gives us light moderate that's a lot of freaking enemies like a lot of freaking enemies ah that's not good operation witch walk indeed oh that's not great so i don't like missions in high advent presence regions it's not good I'm going to try to stop this, though. I'm going to have to. I'm going to have to boost it. And Redfield's definitely going in here. I need to get a weapon for Ray. Legit. Can we get someone... Uh, who's got a SMG? Allie probably has an SMG. Yeah, she does. I'm going to get rid of Nabla for a second. Someone stole Ray's Excalibur, so we're going to have to obviously change that a bit. Uh, take this and make it. Yeah, go ahead. There you go. And then we'll get rid of Atlib, get in Ray... It's all gonna go to hell, but I'll fix it eventually. It's just not having all the- wow, not what I had in mind. Is this how we did it? Is this how we did it? Thank you. God damn. Uh, <laughs> it's just one thing after another, isn't it? Alright, so. Problem is, I also don't have the advanced armor for this mission, and this is probably one of those missions where I would pretty much want the armor. Do we have a grenadier? We don't have a grenadier either. Why the hell not? Where's our grenadier? Ziggy is lightly wounded for eight days. That's the problem. Okay. Or, cool. what if we hit a different squad in this? <laughs> I just watched me screw up the mission. All right, as I just said, victory squad will probably not go on mission anytime soon. Who do we have? A shinobi specialist, technical gunner, ranger, grenadier. That is pretty much what I want on a mission, actually. Let me just pull the. Let me select victory squad here. There, moderate on a six man. The six man is Papa Smorf over here. We've got our crit monkey bard with AP ammo. We've got Crazy Chef with the axes and Guto. We've got an, a Smig on out. Of course, it's the Smig I pulled off. Ru Hignos and Plan B here on... Yes, yeah, so we're going to take that plasma grenade. We're actually probably going to take that in the freaking grenade slot, son. Not that. No, no, give me that grenade slot. There we go. Plasma grenade. And then we'll take the incendiary here. I mean, I'm thinking maybe incendiary is doubling incendiary would be better. Uh, or would they? You know, I'm going to double the plasmas. And so I plate... This gives you two ablative and seven. And do I risk... There is something going funky with that. A different plate on, maybe? No, we just got some right plate. Uh, I almost want to take another grenade on this, because I'm going to need everything I can get out of this. That'll be five grenades in total. You know, I'm going to take it, and I'm just going to try to keep tank safe, which never works, but I'm going to try to keep tank safe. Rukhignos uh, is fine. What did you AWC into? What did you EWC into, girl? Let me see. I think I'm going to take Victory Squad on this. This is too important not to bring out a Prime Squad. ADC ability gives you Sprinter. Ah, yeah, so nothing that would necessarily indicate a particular secondary item. So I'm going to give you Flashbangs because that's going to be beyond helpful in a pinch. Though I would be much happier if you had more health, but you don't. There's our other armor has been committed off-site. And I can't really... Yeah, I might be able to hit that other mission and come back with enough time for the armor. But every minute counts here for the infiltration. Alright, fuck it. I'm just gonna take this off right then. Um, alright. <laughs> we're reconfiguring the mission parameters, and we're gonna give you another gun back there, Adelaide. There you are. Where are you? There we go. Apparently, my choices of weapons are causing people allergic reactions. So I will go ahead and do this. 
They have new things. Suppressor, we have stock, hair trigger, stock, hair trigger, advanced hair trigger. No one's really Overwatch spec here, eh? Not really. I'll give this on, I don't know, you? We haven't done much on the Dissector, I think, so we can do something there. There we go. Oh, you have a hair trigger already. We'll get an advanced hair trigger on there, and... Are you ever gonna use a stock? I highly, highly doubt it, but whatever. Let's put an advanced stock on there, just for the sake of sanity. Might as well put the, uh, the boost on there where it counts. Okay, folks, so this is our squad, I think. We've got our plasmas and our incendiaries. This is for great justice. Uh, we're gonna be running on a moderate with six. This is about the... I'd say upper limit of I'd run a run and I may need to evac like crazy. I'm gonna boost this mission, no question. Objective timer in 14 turns. This is gonna get hairy, I'm not gonna lie. This does not look great for the Gipper, but we'll do what we can with this. I don't know. I'm confident in this crew though, with the Ruhignos tricked out and the loot, we have a lot of firepower and grenades can really be a force multiplier. And if Chef scouts for us, we can probably make this work. So clearly everyone's very excited about this mission, so I'll start the infill and we'll call it a day and I'll see you all next time on Long War 2. Till next time. Till then.